and one KO fighting out of Plantation, Florida and representing his homeland of San Juan, Puerto Rico, Xander Zaya. Overhand right, hands on the side of the head of Winfield. Zayas, Zayas, overhand right, and that puts Winfield the, down. The level. use of length of, uh, of Zayas, you know, he, he kept the distance, oh, kept the man body from punching from the floor. Xander did that so well. He found a home for the overhand right. Winfield steady himself. Back to those power punches and just backing Winfield into the corner. Man, the straight to the body. Good left to the body, and an yeah. overhand right again. The second Three. knockdown Three. of the first round for Four. Xander Zayas. Five. That's it. That's Russell right. He keeps fighting like this. He's going to have a one, one name type of a profile. He won't be calling him Xander Zayas. He'll be calling him Xander, and everybody will know. Big smiles from the 17-year-old. G5 Jeff TV. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. Hit the share button as you come on in. Big shout out to all the sponsors of the channel. All the information is in the description box. And follow your boy on Instagram and Twitter at Box with G5 Jeff TV. Now on the undercard of Joe Smith and jesse hart tonight in atlantic city hard rock casino we got a really really young prospect and when i say young i mean really really young this kid made headlines in boxing because he's the youngest guy to ever sign with bob arum in top rank and his name is xander zayas and he signed with top rank at 16. I think that goes to show how much of a talent they think he is. Signed him at 16 years old. He's going to be fighting on the undercard. He's going to be going up against Corey Champion. And I'm really interested to see how they move Zayas along. I mean, you've seen the highlights in the beginning of the video. He definitely look, he fights like an older fighter. Like, he don't fight like a young fighter. Look like he has a pro style. And... I'm looking forward to see what he does inside of the ring tonight. And you can't take for granted the stage. Like, he's so young. You have to put him in on this type of a stage to see how he handles the stage. It's more so of how he handles the atmosphere more so than the opponent. Like, top rank is really good at putting their prospects in with the proper guys. So... Corey Champion is not even the focus here. It's can you put Zayas on a big card and he can handle it? And the reason I say that is because there's other fighters that are young in their career and some that are young in age and they can't handle the stage. And because they can't handle the stage, they end up taking L's against their opponents. For example, you can look at Deontay Wilder's brother, like Deontay Wilder's brother has taken several losses by knockout. And I think part of it is because the stage is too big. It's too many eyeballs on him. So we're going to see what happens with Xander Zayas tonight. And we're going to see what happens in his career going forward. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section. G5 Jeff TV. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. Please share this video. Support your boy. Support good content at all times. I appreciate y'all. Peace.